Hello out there. A word, please. I am Jedi Master Samanik Timms. Come out of there, friend, so we can talk properly. Good try, but I sense your nature. I know you are Sith. I even know who you are. Many years past, I was the Padawan of Master Noman Kar. He and I forged a bond through the Force. I know about your confrontation with Master Kar and what you did to him. I should have killed that miserable old man when I had the chance. He's never been the same, and he no longer communes with the Force. Ever since you defeated Kar and took Jaysa Wilson, the Jedi Council has been keeping track of you. We know you are no longer aligned with Darth Barriss, and are in fact here to stop Lord Melikost from freeing Darth Ekage. Though Barriss is my enemy, I'm still Sith. I expect nothing else, but your arrival here tells me something. It's a dead end, Sith. To follow Lord Melikost, you need information from the computers in this room, but the door has been fused. I came for the same reason. I got the information, but Lord Melikost's commandos trapped me in here. Outmatched by mere commandos. Not your proudest day. Oh, I don't know. There were quite a lot of them, and I held my own. Our combined strength, striking the door from both sides simultaneously, could break the physical seal. Trouble is, there's a fail-safe force field that makes even that impossible. Now, if you were to take out that force field... If I do this, you'll give me access to the information I need. You have my word. There are several power stations feeding this installation. Destroy them, and the force field will not engage. Then you and I can break through this door, and you can access the prisoner reports. First, I'll see to it you die. If you think you'll have time to waste fighting me, it's your call. Scour the area and destroy the power stations. Then return and start banging on the door. We'll work it out. I'll be waiting. After all, where am I going to go? I have returned, Jedi. The power stations are down. Great. With the force field down, we should be able to break the door open. On three. One, two, three! Well done, Sith. Now, before you think to fight me, I suggest you look at the computers in here. I'd say they've seen better days. Hmm, still smoking. I wonder who could have destroyed them. You just signed your death warrant. Don't be hasty. I did it to make sure no one else sent by Darth Barriss could succeed. That is, after you and I stopped Lord Melikost. Now I'm the only one who knows where to go. Our goals are one, even if our motives vary. I suggest a partnership. I'll keep my anger from consuming me, Jedi. For now. Once the deed is done, we are enemies again. So, no victory celebration then? Too bad. All I'll tell you is that we're headed for Deep Prison. The exact location of Darth Ekage's cell remains my secret. In good faith, I'll point you to her assassins. You can make sure they remain locked up while I get access to the Deep Prison. For the time being, I won't cut you open. I'm thankful. You'll see, it makes sense to do it this way. You might get the assassins to back down without a fight. Me? Not so much. Here are the coordinates. Hollow me when you're done and we'll get together and face the darts. It really will take both of us.
Jim's here. Darth Ekage's assassins have been dealt with. Have you managed to accomplish your part? Well, yes and no. I found a route into the deep prison, but it was a struggle. And unfortunately, the way collapsed behind me. Bad luck, that. We'll have to find a different route to this level. What good are you, then? Now, now, don't forget. You need me. Sending the coordinates for our rendezvous. From there, it's quick to Darth Ekage's cell. Good luck, Sith. I hope you make it. Can't really do this alone. I will tell your master, my brother, the future voice of the Emperor, that you died like a dog. I'm not going to let you deliver that message. Now, exactly who are you? He's with me, Eckage. Nomenkar's sad little whelp. This just gets better and better. If you're aligned with this Jedi, you are a fool and a traitor. Don't worry, he returns to enemy status as soon as you are defeated. I like that you've used this Jedi, primarily because it gives me the chance to end him. Varus will be declared the voice of the Emperor, then he and I shall dominate the Empire. I'm not going to miss that. I just destroyed a lord with a mere flick of my wrist. Don't blink. I'm about to do it again. We fight together. Have my powers waned as I languished here? I am your better. Pretend otherwise. Your heart knows the truth. I'll never understand the pleasure your kind gets from rubbing it in. Before you get any creative ideas, my friend, help me reseal Darth Eckage in her cell. I'm going to let her escape unless you destroy her in cold blood. What? You can't be serious. Your mission would fail. Darth Barris would get his way. Are you willing to risk the consequences if you're wrong? It's the Jedi who care most that Darth Ekage not be unleashed again. You're putting me in a terrible position. I will not kill the defenseless, and yet if Ekage escapes, she won't remain defenseless. It pains me, but I... I have to do it. feel less than I was. It was for your own good. A life of a Jedi is a difficult one, but that was the hardest choice I've faced. I'll have to live with my decision. Now, what's to be between us? Do we part as friends or as enemies? We fight the same foe. Perhaps when this war is over, we will talk. I'll look forward to the opportunity. Good luck to you, Sith. <laughs> you just let him go? Are you getting soft in your old age? You're softening me up, Vet. Now, we return to the ship and inform the Hand that the deed is done. <laughs> 